Alexa, let's play Jeopardy. This is Jeopardy. Sure Thanks, is. Thanks, Johnny, and welcome, players. Thanks, Alex. Today's first game. Look, I'm on the show right now. You are now entering the Twilight Zone. Spoiler alert. In the episode Time Enough at Last, a book lover is the only survivor of a <clears throat> nuclear war, but breaks this. Repeat. Again, the category is, you are now entering the Twilight Zone. Spoiler alert. In the episode Time Enough at Last, a book lover is the only survivor of a nuclear war, but breaks this. Please give your response. But breaks this. You can also say, I, I said... don't know, to continue, or repeat, to hear the clue again. What is, uh, is television? That's not it. The correct <clears throat> response was, what are his glasses? Oh, his glasses? The second category is, you could fix those though, come on. Mapping out Asia. The island of Sri Lanka sits just 20 miles off the southeastern coast of this nation. What is India? Yes, that's correct. The third category is A clue of game. Before Nintendo sent him on an odyssey, Super Mario made his video game debut in this 80s classic. What is Donkey Kong? Correct. The next category is His widow lived on. His widow Kreta Scott. Founded a center for nonviolent social change after his death. Who is Martin Luther King Jr.? Great. <coughs> the fifth category is Lethal Weapon. In 1862, Richard Gatling patented a type of this weapon that bears his name. What is a machine gun? Yes, that's it. The sixth category is. Hand it over. The response contains the word hand. Fitness magazine says the secret to this balancing act isn't in your arms. It's core strength. What is a handstand? You got it. Hard to do. I hope you're ready for another six clues. The next category is... History time. On November 17, 1869, after 10 years of construction, this canal open to navigation. What is the Suez Canal? Yes, that's right. Well, 1869, the eighteen sixty nine date. <clears throat> real names on the marquee. This category is about the real names of movie actors. Annie Hall stars Alan Koenigsberg and Diane Hall are better known by these performing names. Who is Woody Allen and Diane Keaton? That's it. The next category is... 21st Century Fiction. Released in 2006, The Road is a post-apocalyptic novel by this author of All the Pretty Horses. Who is Cormac McCarthy? Yes, that's correct. <clears throat> the 10th category is... Putting up a smoke screen. Merriam-Webster defines it as a tall chimney on a factory for carrying smoke away. What is a smoke stack? That's it. The next category is... Double talk. One author says that depression era dice games gave us the phrase that puts these two words before chicken dinner. What is winner winner? That's right. The final category is <coughs> job fiscation. Bartenders with a POS terminal aren't robots. They're using a modern cash register. POS means point of this. What is sale? That's it. All right. Let's see how you did on this set. Great work. You got 11 of 12 correct. I got 11. You scored in the top 1% of players today. We'll see you tomorrow for more clues. Yeah, I'm on fire this week. I got, I got 11 on Monday, then I got 10 yesterday, and now I just got 11 again. So I'm at 32. I know uh, I'm going to be told that I got like 
29 questions correct this week, but that's obviously incorrect. If you're watching this, you know that's incorrect. But yeah, I don't know. I'd say the clues this week are pretty easy compared to what they were like in previous weeks, like last week and actually last week. The holiday weeks were actually pretty easy. I think I did pretty good. Like I think I got a perfect game or a near-perfect game. A couple of near-perfect games around Christmas. So those were pretty easy, I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'm just doing really well. Let's, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's, um, uh, I don't know. What, what Sorry, I, say? I don't know that one. All right, all right, quiet down over there. But yeah, thank you for watching. I'll review the one Miss Clue, one single Miss Clue. I'll review that down below. And if you want to watch me play more Jeopardy J6 throughout the week and play Team Jeopardy and Sports Jeopardy on the weekends, then boom, subscribe. And here's the video from yesterday where I got 10 answers correct. Thanks for watching.